In question one, in question, <laughs> in question one, you see how they've got sentences, and then we created, excuse me, we created an equation, right? So they're asking us to go in reverse order. If you got given this, what sentence could you craft? It's going to sound like the sentences in question one that would be equivalent to that. I'll give you a hint. I guess I would start with the letter S. S. <laughs> yes, very good. As the cube of X. Yeah. That is pretty much perfect. Okay, because you can see there's X cubed, there's S, and the proportionality, which they, this is the other question they're asking us, right? The constant of variation that controls the proportionality, what's the number? Have a look. It's two. Um, you know it's the constant because no matter what S or X you put into there, um, two stays the same. Every single equation always has two. So you would say K equals two. Dunskis. Um, if you were to have a look at part B. It is a fraction, that's okay. Let's start it off with the bit that we know, right? We would say, what's the first variable? T. T. Varies directly as what? As the digits. Um, Look at the previous question we did. Look in question one. T varies directly as the square root of L. Now what's K? I? Now, this oh. is sneaky, this is sneaky. Have a look at the way we've written every single variation question on the board. Sorry, every single variation equation on the board. I'm going to highlight them for you. I haven't used, I haven't used blue yet. That's amazing. Okay, here we go. Um, 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 here, 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 here. Have a look. No fractions. Every time k is multiplied by the other thing. K is multiplied by the other thing, etc. So in this equation, uh, what is the equation? T? T equals the square root of L over 5. We need to come up with a way to write this so it is something times the square root of L. So what can we put in its place? How can you turn division into multiplication? Hmm. You could do that. What would that be? Dividing by 5 would be be 0 0.2, right? So this is the same as multiplying by 0 0.2. Um, I would probably say, um, that's fine by the way, k is 0 0.2. Um, you didn't have to go to a decimal, you can just say that it's a fifth. That, that a fifth and 0 0.2, same deal, yeah? So in this case, k is not 5, k is uh, 1 over 5, and that's what gives the fraction, okay? 